yeah, baby. Welcome to Chef Bucket Cage Kitchen. God dang. Look here. Today, we're going to have pigs flying all over the bayou. This is my golden brown deep fried pig wings. And I'll show you what I'm doing. Anyway, hang loose. We're going to see what the ingredients are and what it calls for. Then we'll start the cooking. Talk to you later. All right, okay. All right what's it's gonna call for? This is my pig wings right here. Easy, boys, easy now. Look at these rascals. Is that a pig wing or not? I mean, that wing is wrapped, totally wrapped with bacon, and it's going to be deep fried, deep fried pig wings. So, I'm going to start off, I'm going to start by getting my, my wet boys together. I got a couple of them here. All right, let's open up our chicken broth. You know me, I like to put the chicken back in chicken. Oh, that just like some big old yellow eyes. Look at it. No milk. Salt that a little bit. Don't eat a whole lot because my chicken broth got some. Come here, baby. Garlic powder. All right. Get it going real good. All right. Now, as I put that chicken in there, move this over some here. As I put that chicken, that's for later. As I put my chicken in the wet wash, I'm kind of seasoning it just a little bit. I got enough garlic. Checking in like it used to be, you know? I was reading in my little book the other day, I put together how to clean a chicken, a yard bird, what you save on the inside and all that. And I, I'm like, man, I tell you, they don't do, you don't have that option no more. All right. All right, let me get my little. Batter together right here. These wings have been soaking in my chicken broth. I got that bacon wrapped pretty tight. But it don't mean that I want to go crazy with it. You know, you still want to take it easy because when you have guests, you don't want a strip of bacon hanging around. You want it on your chicken. Look at that. And that's sufficient. Now we're going to start putting it around here. Grease is hot and 350. I'm putting this in here. I'm going to fry it for 13 minutes. And that should be sufficient. Well, that's some big wings too, boy. Let me tell you what, them pigs got some wings. 
There we go. You go, baby. Settling down. Well, I got you. Let me talk a little bit about Dixie. Love my beer. Do all of it. You can still get it over here. Ah, yeah. I got a couple, well, I got a couple more minutes left on these pig wings. Yeah, you can say you saw it first on my channel. Now look at here. See all that, see that bacon around that thing there, how pretty that is? You can almost swear, you can almost swear that's a chicken wing, huh? <laughs> Seriously, I fix these for parties. We do parties with this. Uh, I, I, I guess maybe 15 people at a time. You know, I, I'll go ahead and uh, tackle up all these little uh, pig, pig wings, you know, uh, two wings per hog. Uh, that means I'm going to need seven and a half hogs. So I, I'll get eight hogs to take these wings off of. So listen, you want to have a party around here? Holler at me, we'll set it up. We'll have a pig wing jamboree. Got that. One thing about the bayou, a lot of partying on the bayou. Time is up. I know my chicken's done. We're cutting it off. We're taking it in before it gets too cold out here. I fry mine at, at 350, don't forget that, 350. Fire on, grease, grease drain. Oh man, 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 man. I mean, look at this. Look at the wrap on there. Look at that. Look at the wrap on these rascals. Anyway, these are going in. And they'll be served up this afternoon. Look here, this chef bouquet, and I'm shutting it down. Gonna get my flying pig wings and do my thing. It's been a pleasure. See y'all later. Aye, oh yeah, baby. God dang. All right, sissy, let's go.